Hey there, Conflict to Encourage, December 27th, all things through Christ. Psalms 56, 3 says, what time I am afraid, I will trust in thee. Only the sense of God's presence can banish the fear that for the timid child would make life a burden. Let him fix in his memory the promise, the angel of the Lord encampeth round about them that fear him and delivereth them. Let him read that wonderful story of Elisha in the mountain city and between him and the host of armed foemen, a mighty encircling band of heavenly angels. <clears throat> Let him read how to Peter in prison and condemned to death, God's angel appeared, how past the armed guards, the massive doors and great iron gateway with their bolts and bars the angel led God's servant forth in safety. Let him read of that scene on the sea when to the tempest tossed soldiers and seamen, worn with labor and watching and long fasting, Paul the prisoner on his way to trial and execution spoke those grand words of courage and hope. Be of good cheer, for there shall be no loss of any man's life among you. For there stood by me this night the angel of God, whose I am and whom I serve, saying, Fear not, Paul, thou must be brought before Caesar, and lo, God hath given thee all them that sail with you. In the face of this promise, Paul assured his companions, There shall not an hair fall from the head of any of you. And so it came to pass because there was in that ship one man through whom God could work. The whole shipload of heathen soldiers and sailors were preserved. Maybe God can use you like that. They escaped all safe to land. These, <coughs> excuse me, these things were not written merely that we might read and wonder, but that the same faith which wrought in God's servants of old might work in us in no less marked a manner when he wrought then will he work now wherever there are hearts of faith to be channels of his power let the self-distrustful whose lack of self-reliance leads them to shrink from care and responsibility be taught reliance upon god thus many a one who otherwise would be put a cipher in the world perhaps only a helpless burden, will be able to say with the Apostle Paul, I can do all things through Christ, with which strengtheneth me. Hope you have a great day today. Live courageously.